All right, in this video, we're going to cover the installation process for Nest Egg software. It's uh, easy and straightforward. If you're downloading the software from nesteggsoftware.com, there's two places you can do it. There's a download now button here on the home page, or you can go to the download tab, and you'll see it there as well. Um, with all of Nest Egg software, we allow you to have a 30-day trial, so we want you to try it before you buy it. So during the installation process, we will not be asking you for your credit card or email or any registration information at all. We just want you to get the software. It's a fully functioning piece of software, and we want you to use it for 30 days. Make sure you're happy with it before you buy it from us. Also, uh, if you download the software from one of our affiliate partners or our business partners, you'll see a similar uh, download icon on their website as well, and the steps will be pretty much the same. So let's just go ahead and click Download Now. What you're going to get is a run or save. You could save the executable or just go ahead and hit run. You're going to get this uh, security warning which is nothing to worry about. All it's doing is telling us or telling you that uh, our software currently doesn't have the, you know, the VeriSign digital signature which we will get shortly but it's uh, completely safe to go ahead and install. So you just go ahead and hit run. Do you want to make the change to computer? Say yes. Now if you have a version of Nest Egg software already installed. If you're um, upgrading from one version to another, you're going to get this setup warning screen. And we just put that there to uh, alert you that when you install the new software, you're going to lose all of your data, all the data that's in your database. And so we're asking you to go ahead and export your database. And we'll show you later on how to go do that. But it's simply uh, at the top in the navigation of Nest Egg software, if you've previously installed it, you'll see a database import export function. So then you just export the data to your desktop or wherever, and then you can import it back in after, after you've installed the software. So if you don't have a previous version, if this is your first time installing it, you won't see this screen. So I'm just going to say yes because I've already backed mine up. Again, we're being safe, so we give you a double warning. Are you sure you want to do it? Yes, we do. So then the software as you see installs very quickly. I, well, I just uninstalled my previous version. I hit OK, then Next, accept our terms and conditions and our licensing agreement. Hit Next. You have your choice. Uh, do you want a desktop icon, quick start menu, and quick launch? You can select or unselect those as, as you wish. And then hit Next and Install. And the entire program is only about 18 megabytes, so that's about how fast it installs. It only takes a few seconds on a, on a normal internet connection. So you go ahead and hit finish. I'm going to go ahead and close this window, and you can see there's the icon on my desktop. Go ahead and open it for the first time. Now on some computers and some operating systems, you'll see that it'll kind of open off to the right-hand corner. That's a Windows thing that, that we don't control, so just grab it drag it to where you want it. Once you move it and you close the software out, come back to it, it'll stay in that position that you you remembered. Or you can grab this uh, grabber button down here and resize it appropriately or maximize, if you will, the screen any way that you want to. That's pretty much it. It's pretty easy to install. In the next session, we'll talk about uh, starting, adding an account, and scenarios, and using your software. So there's one more thing I wanted to show you. Uh, what you'll see during the 30-day trial period is a Buy Now button at the top of your screen. And that will remain there until you purchase it. And it shows you at the bottom of the screen 30 days left in trial period. And that will count down and tell you how many days you left. You have left in your trial period. Once you're ready to buy it, simply hit Buy Now and it will launch the uh, PayPal process. Let's go ahead and show you. That. You'll see this here. Um, once this comes up, you have the choice to buy either the consumer or the advisor version, whichever you'd like. So we're going to enter our name, company, and our email. And then we're going to go ahead and purchase the consumer version. Now this is automatically integrated with PayPal, so once you've done that, uh, you can pay with a credit card or through PayPal. Uh, we'll go ahead and pay with a credit card. And 
and I won't type all of this in with my credit card information, but you basically go ahead and fill that out and hit review and continue and then it will purchase the software, the buy now button will go away and then you'll be presented with a screen uh, that says activate now. Simply click the activate now and that's it. Your software's paid for and activated.